Hello there people, welcome back to a new video. In this one we are looking at HCMC. So it is Monday, I hope that you've not worked too hard, I hope that you've had a wonderful day, but we are talking about money in this episode because money is something that you would have made if you'd have bought HCMC last week at the lows. Today this stock is up about 5% which isn't the most significant and this is something that I talked about in last night's episode. I said Monday will hopefully push us into the green and it has done so. I said that I don't think it will be by too much and that has apparently been the case which is a good thing to see. Well tonight I'm talking about what has happened today, given my personal reactions, talking about what I can personally see happening tomorrow as well, and that kind of stuff for HCMC. If you may enjoy this episode and you haven't already, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and leave a like on the video because every single subscriber does help. On top of that, if you wanted to support the channel, please press the join button and you can donate a small amount to the channel each month, it really would support us. With that being shared though, let's jump in. Right, so other than this stock, I want to focus on two indexes or indices. First, I want to have a quick look at the Russell 2000, which is an index which shows 2000 of the America's smallest cap stocks. And we can see that this index is up by quite a significant amount today, which is pretty good. If we have a quick look over to the S&P, however, the S&P is still up as well. So generally speaking, the market has kind of recovered from that sell-off that we have been seeing last week. And HCMC has kind of subsequently followed in this market trend. I think that is a good thing to see. So if the market can stay positive this week overall, I think that a stock like HCMC will have another good chance of coming back up in strength and in price. Now I've talked about HCMC in last night's episode where I said yes, it is a decent stock and it definitely does have some potential, especially going forwards with that Philip Morris lawsuit that definitely is going to bring a lot of attention for it. That could make it a decent swing trade or a short term trade, i.e. by now, sell out closer to that uh, lawsuit date and potentially make some profits in between. But overall, if you're in HCMC, I suppose you probably are in for the long term now i do personally own shares of hcmc i've talked about this one before just letting you know that but yeah guys i definitely can see a lot of stuff coming for this one going forwards a lot of people have been talking about the target of one dollar i'm going to say it right now i've said it before i think one dollar isn't an impossible target but i think it's not going to happen overnight and i think another thing is people really do need to kind of get their uh, you know aspirations and goals with this stock a little bit more uh let's say discreet in the sense that yes it does have that potential to pop to one dollar but let's just say that it's going to pop to maybe two times what it is now or even four times what it is now or more than that and that would still give us a fairly decent return and that is a hundred percent possible overall though it definitely could pop to one dollar long term if you are willing to hold for that long and it definitely could be a fantastic opportunity now looking at HCMC into tomorrow, I think tomorrow will be relatively flat, but I would like to see this one come back ever so slightly again. I think it won't move too much, but I think if we can come back a little bit more and build a bit more strength going into next week, finishing this week positive, that would be another good sign. I'm not too certain that it is going to break past last week last week's highs. I don't think that's a bad thing at all. It might take a while for that to happen, but that's not necessarily a bad thing either. HCMC, like I said, is a speculative play, but it is definitely a stock which you should hold if you are willing to buy it and I definitely think it is another one which you should not put in more than you're willing to lose because yes there is big potential on the upside but we need to also talk about risk management and see the potential worst case scenario and plan for that as well. So would I buy HCMC right now? Honestly I would but if I was going to buy it with a large position I would definitely be dollar cost averaging or cost averaging in the sense that say I was going to buy 100,000 shares I might buy 10,000 shares a day for the next 10 days and that way just in case it does go down or up significantly in price you'll definitely be getting the the best price action or at least the best entry points that we could possibly see happening but right now i do think that good things are coming for this one it was pretty flat on friday which is a good thing to see and of course going into today to into today we are back in the green ever so slightly i think this is really quite good now i think it is back on the growth and i think if the whole market can carry on climbing this one will continue to climb but right now it is pretty uncertain but personally i do believe this week is going to be quite green i'm not sure how green it's going to be but i think it is going to be enough to give us some profits if you buy the stock now and personally like i said i wouldn't put too much into it but i definitely would consider it a decent buy but of course i am not a financial advisor please make sure to do your own research so yeah, HCMC, I definitely think going into tomorrow can see a little bit more growth. I don't think it will be too significant. That's not a bad thing. If you are buying this stock, it is for the long term. But I would love to hear your strategies down below. Honestly, I am happy with how this one has moved today. Are you happy? Please tell us down below as well. And I would like to see tomorrow be positive. But I'll be telling you all of my opinions tomorrow on what we have seen. So make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in that one. Goodbye.